A lot of ladies will have a chance to say yes to the dress after getting a Valentine's Day proposal yesterday. Event planner Jennifer Edwards is here now with some trends for brides and bridesmaids. Great to have you with us. Thank you. Lots Always of fun trends. Here. Yes, absolutely. Why don't we jump right in and look at our first model Let's um, do. with an absolutely gorgeous dress. This is a feather fantasy. <laughs> I mean, the bride that would choose this gown is something else. And uh, you'll see all the detail down to the um, little florets on the on the train there and then uh, oh yeah the sparkle can't miss that the, back the beautiful is beaded too. back mm -hmm. absolutely yeah this dress does not stop it's amazing the flowers are so pretty too yes and we'll talk about those absolutely so what we've done is um taken cues from the skirt itself and from the little florette on the side and worked all these mm -hmm. um shapes into the into the bouquet itself so we have a gonus and air plants and uh ranunculus, which tie the whole piece together. It really does, it's gorgeous. Thank you, Nicole. Our next model is coming in with a dress um, that really is befitting of a rock star. It <laughs> is, and again, it's so hard sometimes to tell um, on camera of how detailed this is, but it's literally ripped pieces of English netting. Wow. Mixed with lace, and so, um, we, and then we have the compliment of the bridesmaid who is rocking a jumpsuit, which will be on trend this year, as well as I've the never seen that. I know, right? Yeah. So, um, and also a daring color palette, which we love. Mm -hmm. And it doesn't have to be matchy poo with the brides. I mean, you know, personality. Let's let everyone have theirs. Um, and uh, likewise, her bouquet is uh, echoing the the kind of jaunty nature of the yeah. skirt with the um, calla lilies and their pointiness, but just a little softness with the roses to complement the lace as well. It pairs beautiful. Thank you so much, ladies. Thank you. All right, here's another fun dress and another <laughs> look I have never seen before. <laughs> this is beautiful. <laughs> I love her. She is her bouquet. <laughs> wow. Now, um, so the details of her gown, it's almost like a wave of this beautiful line and just lends to a crawling vine of floral. Um, and they echo down all the way to the back, actually, and um, on her train as well. But uh, this is just a lovely, I mean, imagine a garden wedding or a brunch yes. wedding in this gown and, you know, just being bold enough to, to pull this off. Yeah, and with the right bride, this could be real. A exactly. show stopping moment. Exactly. Gorgeous. Thank you very much. Beautiful. Our next model is one that our News Channel 5 friends will recognize. This is Sophie Nielsen Colding, who is getting married in June, right? I am. Yeah, yeah. This is not her dress, but this We're would done. be a gorgeous choice. Yes, absolutely. This silhouette is just stunning and classic and, again, on trend with the off shoulder and just simple lines. It, um, you know, the bride is the star anyway, mm -hmm. and we always want to focus back on the bride and not overwhelm her either in the gown or the floral um, selection, but this floral is literally um, designed to be held downward and uh, can graze the floor. I mean, it's so pretty. It's a fashion piece. It's it a really statement. <laughs> Sophie, you're going to be a beautiful bride. Thank you. Thanks for being Draw with run, us. right? <laughs> so well the cool played. thing is, these dresses that you have shown us today and others are going to be offered in a charitable way. Absolutely, absolutely. For I'm offering the ones featured today for $500, and those proceeds will go to the um, recent shooting in Fort Lauderdale. Wow. All right. That's a, a very generous thing to do. Well, happy to do it. These gowns have always had a higher purpose, I've believed. So. Okay, great. We're going to put all that information on our website. If you'd like to buy a dress that you've seen today, Jennifer's contact information will be at newschannel5.com. And tomorrow, Jennifer's going to be back with us to tell us what trends we're going to be seeing at weddings and receptions. Some unusual ideas there, too, so be sure to stay tuned for that. Thanks so much. Thank you. Now let's head over to Leland.